The sell-off started overseas today. A profit warning from the French bank Societe Generale sparked fresh fears about the health of Europe's biggest banks. The group being stung by a trio of concerns, weak economic growth, fear of rising bad debts in their portfolios, and low interest rates. And all this comes as Eurozone finance ministers meet in Brussels, and Julia Chatterley is there. Eurozone finance ministers just wrapping up their meeting here in Brussels. And I can tell you, never mind what was on the agenda, all the focus here was on what the Eurozone finance ministers make of the current pressure that we're seeing on banking stocks and bonds. And actually, the message was pretty consistent. The president of the Eurogroup said to me, look, we're concerned, we're watching it. But at the same time, he believes it's far more about what's going on elsewhere in the world and the external pressure that we're seeing on equity markets than it is about being a specific European issue. He said, look, the banks are in a far stronger position today than they were back in 2007. Capital is far higher and there's all sorts of measures in place that governments and the central bank can enact if they need to stabilise the environment. That was the broader message. And actually, as one commissioner said to me too at the end of this meeting, investors need to have a cold-blooded rational look once again at the market and at European banking stocks. The question is, will they? For Nightly Business Report, I'm Julia Chatterley in Brussels.